Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be testing out my Gajuino versus my Decent. So if you're interested, stay tuned and let's get brewing. So I have not dialed in the coffee yet, so I'm gonna go ahead and give it my best guess as to what grind size I would need. I'm doing 19 grams in and 50 out. And I am using the Pullman basket. So I'm going to try to do the exact same thing for both, so once I'm gr uh, done grinding, I'm just going to wiggle it, uh, one tap, and then I'm going to use my Normcore spin distribution needle tool, which I find works really well to distribute the grinds. So one spin, and then one tap. And then just go in with with a tamp and a polish. So let's get to the shot and see how good my guess of grind size is. So I'm going to go do the same thing, just a wiggle, one tap, my needle distribution tool, one spin, one tap, and then do the champ. Let's see how the uh, Gajuina does. So 33 versus 32, I would say extremely accurate with the same profile. And same times, same temperature. So let's try these out. So I'm gonna do a taste test. Starting with the decent shot. Okay, vibrant. Pretty, pretty decent shot. And then this one is the Gajuino. It's a little bit warmer, but hopefully it doesn't change the, change it too much.
It's a little bit more vibrant on the Gajuino, which I suspect it might be because of the temperature difference, but overall pretty similar shots. I mean, they ran the same, the same time, same pressure, same water, same temperature. Uh, basically, I was able to replicate the same shot off the decent on the Gajuino. So, so far it's very, very similar results. So let's do the steaming. I'll do the steaming on my Gaja and then do it on the decent. So I'm gonna use my Kruv three uh, spout pitcher uh, to steam. And then I'll show you exactly how long it takes to get it ready on the Gaja and go from there. So once you have your milk ready, you basically just switch the steam and if it's, I believe, under two bars of pressure, it pumps up up to two bar. And then I have the temperature set to 165. So it takes about, I would say, 20 seconds to get to steam ready. And so at one, around 135, it allow, uh, shows you that you're ready to steam. There it is, and I usually purge my wand and then wait until it's up to like 150, 160, and then we can go and steam. So this. It does start out very violently because it builds up pressure up to like five bars it shows. Or t it could even go up to ten. But it obviously quickly drops once you start steaming. And then you just proceed. And then it pumps up up to two bar whenever it gets below two bar. Which is a, an amazing feature that was added with the Gajuino mod. Because I thought the steaming was very inconsistent, but with this, it basically makes it perfectly consistent every time. And then wipe the wand. So that's the process and exact time it takes to steam on the Gajuino. Um, here's the milk quality. I mean, perfect microphone, just as good as any other machine I've ever used. It's perfect. So let's uh, pour some art. I actually never poured art into a uh, tulip cup yet with this, with this uh, So one thing I find with this picture is you can't really swirl it very well. So I do my best. So there's my first latte, and now I'll do the same process with my decent uh, steam up the milk and then go from there. Decent, I just do a quick purge. And then go in with the steaming. Let's show a higher temperature based on the temperature of the steaming on the decent, but it steams just about the same time, so I'm not sure. Maybe maybe uh, just a bit faster on the decent, and it is 2.5 bar, so a little bit more pressure. And then just gonna turn off, and then it does like a purge type thing. And then 
wipe it down and then just click stop and then it purges your wand for you automatically it's a pretty nice feature I think it does do it just slightly quicker same thing nice uh, texture nice microphone I would not say any less any worse or so just about the same like very good high quality high quality foam so let's do this one I'll do the sharp point this time make it a little interesting see if I can get a little more detail into it Definitely pours completely different with this tip. Not about the same with this specific latte. So here's the previous one. Yeah, I would say the milk steaming is basically identical as far as texture ease I mean on the decent it's instant but on the gadget it's about a 30 second wait so the results are I would say just about the same as far as quality of milk froth in the cup so yeah let's uh, let's do a taste test and see if there's much of a difference So yeah, very tasty, um, very good, sweet, um, I mean it's got all the, the fruitiness and just, just a very good, good uh, smooth flavors. On the decent. I mean, I'm, I'm not sure what the difference is, but on the decent, it has a very distinctive different flavor. Like this one just has, you know, a very good coffee flavor and it's got all the, all the uh, flavor notes and it's just balanced. It's like no flavor is like really jumping out. But on this one, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what the what the flavor note, how to describe it. But it's definitely got like some kind of a man. Definitely not the same tasting cup. I mean, completely different. I w I'm actually pretty shocked to um, to see and taste the difference, and it is like very different tasting. So the tasting notes are supposed to be brown sugar, pineapple, orange, and honey. Yeah, I think the orange, the orange is coming through with the with the decent. Uh, shot latte like a lot more pronounced orange flavor and then this one is more of a this one's more of a like I would say pineapple is more pronounced in this one than then this one's more orange and this one's more pineapple So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I was pretty surprised to find out that the taste is quite different between the two machines even though the shots were basically identical. Um, the only thing I think would have changed is the temperature and the stability of the temperature. And yeah, overall 
I mean, the Decent obviously has a much better dispersion of water. The whole design is just next level compared to the to the Gaja style. Obviously, it only has I think it's four four uh, holes in the uh, dis dispersion disc versus the the Decent that has like a whole array of dispersion. So the Decent obviously is going to have an upper hand. I mean, it's it's a much more premium machine, and I am excited to say that. Um, it does make a difference and uh, the Decent definitely brings out more flavor and it's just an overall better better cup. But if you are on a budget and you're handy and you can make a Gajuino, absolutely go for it. That's probably the best machine you can, you can, you're can you going to get for probably around 800 bucks, I think with all the mods. If you're able to either buy one that's already modded or do it yourself, I uh, highly recommend uh, for the price it's basically unbeatable but the decent obviously much much more accurate uh, temperature stability and repetition and uh, steaming is the steaming is obviously um, instant you don't have to wait at all uh, their heat up times are actually pretty similar uh, the decent they say around five minutes it does have a built-in uh, group head heater which obviously would heat the heat up quicker uh, but the the Gaja Pro heats up pretty quick, about five minutes. Last time I measured, uh, be from room temperature to fully heated and ready to brew. So it does heat pretty quick. It's a very small boiler, and it is pretty impressive for what it is. Uh, for I mean, for like eight hundred dollars, I mean that's just that is I would say the best bang for your buck that you can ever find in a, in an espresso machine. Being able to uh, do pro, uh, pressure profiling and all the other things that the Gajuino enables you to do. In a future video, I'm going to do a more in-depth take on both of these machines and talk about the downsides and uh, upsides of each one. And yeah, stick around for that video. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this one for today and see you in the next one.